guys, welcome back to our channel. Today is a great day because, drum roll please, it is Stitch Fix Unboxing Day. I'm so excited to do this. I will leave my last Stitch Fix Unboxing video in the comments or not in the comments, but in like the description bar below. If you have not checked that one out, you can check that one out. I go into more detail about what Stitch Fix is. I, I am not gonna go into too much detail in this video about what Stitch Fix is because I'm sure if you're watching this, you've probably watched a hundred more other Stitch Fix videos like I have, so you probably know what the company is all about. If you don't, I will leave a brief description in the box below telling you a little bit about what Stitch Fix is and what to expect from it and I will also leave my name if you want to request me to style you because like I said in my last video I actually work for the company as a stylist and I would love to style you so if you want to request me I'll leave my first and my last name and also if you are not signed up yet I will leave my link below for you to sign up with um are you guys ready because I'm so freaking ready for this. I'm so excited. Okay, I'm gonna open this with my keys because, ooh, I don't feel like going to get a knife. It's kind of like a really, really heavy box this month. All right, so when you open it, this is what it looks like. You will have your burrito wrapped full of amazing items. This burrito is so big. Oh, look at it. It's huge. It's like, I think the f biggest um, burrito I've ever had, I guess you could say. I'm so excited. I sent myself a ton of neutral colors. Oh, for a second, I thought I wasn't even recording. That would have been awful. Okay, I sent myself a ton of neutrals and just fall-ish colors. All right, so the first item is the Fate Omeo Trench Jacket. Is my camera picking that up? No, it's not. Okay, I'll just leave it in the description. I sent myself this because if you watched my last video you would have seen I sent myself a blush trench raincoat and I loved it. I did end up exchanging in my video. I said I received the medium. I did end up exchanging for the small and I'm so glad I did. I have worn that piece so many times since I received it and I actually got a compliment on it so it was really really cool to be acknowledged for such an amazing piece because I'm a absolutely in love with that so I did send myself this trench jacket it is double breasted it has buttons all down the front of it and this piece retails for $98 so it is pricey I have to admit it is a lot softer and light than the other trench joke trench joke trench jacket I received that one is um like a it's a raincoat material and it gets so hot in it which is great for like the chillier weather but I like to wear it, you know just on normal days and sometimes I got way too hot wearing that but this feels a lot lighter I actually didn't expect it to um be so soft and it is Okay, the next piece I sent myself is the Dual Nature Kea Knit Jumpsuit, I believe. I am pronouncing that right. I'm not even sure if you guys are picking up these tags, but whatever. It is a black jumpsuit, long-sleeved, and um, it has long pants. This piece is so soft again. It just feels like amazing quality. I feel like all of our products feel really great and they're all really, really nice quality. So that's what I love about Stitch Fix. Um, not just working there, but as a client myself. And I love just simple black jumpsuits because you can totally dress these up with heels, like a nude heel and a statement necklace. Or you could dress them down and honestly wear like tennis shoes or Uggs with them and just be cozy with like the trench jacket over that would be totally cute. I would probably pair this with 
uh, pointed toe nude heels or open toed strappy nude heels or red heels would look amazing for the holidays as well dressed up with a statement necklace or a bracelet um so i'm really excited to try this piece on okay this next piece is probably the piece i'm most excited for if i didn't already say that about the trench jacket but i'm so excited for this piece you've probably seen it in our ads i believe it was in an email or it's on like the stitch fix website i'm not stitch fix website i'm not really sure it is the collective com con i don't even see the name of it oh my god okay it's hold on side note okay it is called the collective concepts lacy ruffle off the shoulder sweater that right there just said that this was made for me my dog her name is lacy she is my entire life i will insert her picture right now right there isn't she adorable she's perfect her name's lacy this is ruffle sleeved it's adorable i was just so excited for this piece already but now now it's named after my dog like i have to get it even if i hate it so it's just gray it's a knit it has this thick banded ruffle piece on it ruffles are still on trend they have been on trend all spring all summer all fall they're probably going to be on trend all the way well into next year i'm so excited to wear this and i feel like off the shoulder pieces just look really cute but also a little sexy because you get to see your collarbone you get to see your shoulders I do have a tattoo on my shoulder that I'm totally regretting at the moment, so that kind of like takes away from it, but I just feel like off the shoulder pieces are so elegant and cute. All right, this next piece is the Cotton Emporium Azalea Mock Neck Pullover in blush. I have been on a blush hype. I had to send myself this when I saw it. It's this gorgeous baby pink blush mock neck sweater which has this fun little like cable detail all down the sleeves oh, I'm so excited to try this I feel like this piece would look amazing with a really pretty statement necklace over it and just a pair of either white jeans with it tucked in a little into the um into the uh what's it called like the waistline with nude heels of course because i'm obsessed with nude heels or even just denim blue jeans maybe a pair of leggings and uggs for a cute little fall look i'm so excited to try this piece on and the last piece is the moon river johanna v-neck cable neck detail no 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 the Moon River Johanna V-neck Cable Detail Pullover in taupe. I did size down on this because it did look oversized online. So once it's on, I will let you guys know if you do want to get this piece, if you should size down or keep your normal size. I did an extra small, and as you can tell, the extra small looks pretty big. So it has this gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous cable detail all down the front of it. I'm obsessed with, like, fall cozy pieces and this just reminds me of a piece you would wear with like jeans or leggings on like a rainy day sipping your like latte at your favorite coffee shop and then go home and just get a big duvet cover and lay on the couch and chill in this with your favorite show stranger things anybody has anybody been watching that please don't ruin it for me i'm only on episode two and has cable detail all down the sleeve as well and the back does not have the cable detail it's just um like braided all down the back of it i'm so excited to try this piece on and i don't think i've been telling you the prices so let me do that really fast so the first item which was the trench jacket was 98 dollars the um, I think I was I think the jumpsuit I did next was um, $54 which isn't bad the um, pink blush um, I'm so lost right now hold on a second the pink blush cotton emporium sweater is 44 so that's a pretty good deal this ruffle piece that I'm in love with is $58 and then this moon river cable net 
pullover, which is such a heavyweight piece, guys, is $68. But you get a lot of freaking fabric for that price. Like, $68 sounds like a lot for a pullover. But, I mean, if you guys... I mean, this, this is probably what weighed the most in the whole fix. Like, this was what was weighing my, my box down. It's such a thick and cozy fall heavyweight sweater. Alright, guys. So, I just tried everything on. I, I'm totally stuck, you guys. So... There's pieces I love, and then there's pieces I like. So, pieces I love. The trench jacket, I love it. I am just very into the, like, I feel like this is high fashion. I feel like it's very elegant. It looks professional. It's very versatile. You could wear it with work pants, a skirt, and heels, or you could dress it down with a pair of denim jeans. So I feel like I get a lot of use out of it, especially because it is lightweight. You, it's not suffocating. And I feel like it fit very well. I think I will end up keeping this piece. It is pricey. Um, but I feel like I will get a ton of use out of it. And I feel like it's one of those purchases where if I don't get it, I'm going to regret it in the future. You know, when you find something you really like and you're like, well, like, do I need it? Do I not need it? And then you don't end up buying it. And then like you can't stop thinking about it. It happens to me sometimes this blush sweater is gorgeous I love baby pink or blush whatever I love the color but I'm probably not going to keep this although I think if you do get it in your fix try it with pink or try it with white jeans and a pair of booties or nude heels I think that'll look so cute then this piece you guys which you know I was so excited for I like it I don't love it. I do recommend trying this at least in your fix. Recommend I recommend asking your stylist um, to send it to you just so you can try it because it's so cute and it's so fashion forward. It's so on trend. There's so much you can do with it and just how different ways you can style it and it's just so cute. The next piece, I think I'm keeping this one. This is the most cozy like fall, winter sweater ever. I don't know why I'm so happy with this piece, but um, Thank God I ordered a size down. I did size down to an extra small, and I know when I style my clients, if I feel like this will be a great piece for them, I'm probably, depending on their bust size and everything, um, going to send them a size down just because I feel like it's so oversized already that you really don't need your true small or your true medium. You just size it down, and it'll fit great. I probably will keep this piece. I loved it. Totally recommend this piece. Like, if you're looking for, like, a really high-quality jumpsuit that's black, that's very versatile, you could dress it up, you can dress it down, you literally could wear this to, like, a wedding with heels and a statement necklace. I'm not even kidding. I know it's super casual, depending, obviously, how elegant the wedding is, but, like, you could totally wear this to a wedding. That was all. Let me know what you liked. Let me know if you're going to have your stylist send you any of these pieces. Um... Again, if you want me to style, sorry, if you want me to style you, I will leave my name down below. I'd love to style you. And I think that's everything. Do not forget, sorry, that sounded very intense. Do not forget to like this video. Give it a thumbs up, please. Most importantly, hit that subscribe button. That's what I'm like most thankful for. I am starting a blog. I will link that down below if you want to follow it and follow us on social media. And I think that's everything. So thank you for watching. Bye.